this is Leah from ColouringQueen.net and I want to show you the new book today by colouring book artist Rachel Reiner and you might remember her from Desert Wonderland and Botanical Wonderland she does all these gorgeous images that just look fantastic the way that she colours them with this sort of watery type background and beautiful effects and they're just gorgeous images that she does and if you check out her uh, social media you'll see some of those pictures I've reviewed this one previously so you can have a a look at it on my channel if you're interested in that one so what she's done is she's brought out a technique guide and I have quite a few of these in my stack that is never ending to do but this one really took my fancy because of Rachel's particular style of coloring and I was really looking forward to getting this book now it's a super thick book I think it's about 128 pages for memory and she takes you through the techniques of colouring in so just you know have a look at these leaves and how beautiful they look uh, when she you know goes through and colours it so inside we've got a colour book which is lovely we've got this coloured image over here something to give you inspiration got a plain title page now this is on colour uh, paper so you can't really use that with your markers etc it's a, a different feel it's like a glossier paper got an introduction from the author and then we've got the table of contents so I'm going to go through this with you because I don't really think it's very fair to Rachel if I showed you in detail all the techniques etc in this book that she covers I will flick through it quickly but unfortunately people could just read that and not purchase her book which wouldn't be very fair to her so in the contents we've got uh, the different types of mediums that you can use to color in a bit of color theory uh, some techniques and then a step-by-step -step guide to working with colour. So creating shadows, uh, burnishing, using uh, Vaseline, um, using gel pens, etc. Dry brushing, wet painting, adding in little details and colouring skin and hair. So, and you can see from this artwork, she, you know, she really does know how to colour in. She is very, very talented. So... Over the page we've just got some introduction and then the colour studio. Now there are pages and pages of techniques so I'll just pick them all out and they're all step by step so she takes you through picture by picture showing you how to colour something in, adding water backgrounds, doing a night sky creating a, a glow around so you can see already there's a lot of technique there and it's all step by step with little pictures showing you and guiding you along the way now as I said I'm not going to show you the full thing because I don't think that would be very fair to Rachel but I think you can see from enough what she is actually showing you and what the final result is so we've got some adding little details, those little extras that really make a picture pop. Doing skin and hair. Creating this gemstone look. And we've seen these gemstones and crystals done um, numerous ways. And this is sort of a different look from what I've previously seen. And then she's included 24 odd practice pages and a great big list of resources. So this image, um, you could colour it in, but it's still on that colour printing paper, which is a glossy type paper. Over here, these images are printed on a white paper. It's a medium quality and it's perforated so that you can remove it. My only quibble with it is that it's printed double sided so if you wanted to use some watercolour techniques it's not going to be as nice as if it was single sided. So we've got our practice pages here and they're all in Rachel's distinctive style that she draws botanicals and nature in. 
so you can practice what she's taught you. Uh, you've seen those flip throughs on the mushrooms and the crystals, so now you can try them out yourself in the actual book. We've got lovely little feathers, and her work always has such a, a delicacy to it, but such a vibrancy, so that's why I was super excited to get this book, even though I've got a number of technique books. So when you were doing the skin and hair tutorial with her on that step-by-step, -step, there's a picture to colour, there's your crystals to colour in, all your different types of flowers and petals, mushrooms, different types of leaves. Always good to learn new techniques with leaves. Our books seem to be filled with them. And there we have it. So that's it from Rachel Reiner. A lovely colouring book full of techniques. I'm super pleased that I purchased it and I can't wait to dig in and try it. I hope you enjoyed this review. The links to buy it are below the video. Until next time, happy colouring.